Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So for our daily dose of the new Bing chat, um, just to let you know about um, a couple of new changes that Microsoft has recently made to the new Bing with the chatbot ChatGPT over the last day or so. Now, um, the first is that um, Microsoft uh, is basically um, bringing better formatting for math solutions to the new Bing chat. And uh, apparently, um, this was announced uh, in a Twitter post, a tweet by Microsoft, where they have um, demonstrated and showed off a new and um, a kind of a much better looking format for showing math solutions in the new Bing chat. And uh, um, Microsoft said that it's currently been tested only by about 10% of Bing chat users. And at this stage, though, um, I'm not one of those 10%, but nonetheless, um, I'm sure that you will get the general idea by the end of this video. And Microsoft says that if you aren't seen it um, as yet, like I am not, um, it's coming soon to Bing Chat near you. So it is on a controlled phase rollout, better math solutions coming to Bing. So just to demonstrate for today's video, currently um, if you ask, and I'm just going to copy in um, inverse Fourier transform equation. So that's quite a mouthful, but just take my word for it. Um, currently when you ask uh, Bing search, to um, give you a math solution. Uh, it looks a little bit complicated. Um, there's quite a lot going on. And uh, um, you'll see now in a second when that just um, opens up that search. And I still see that the search is taking a bit of time and Microsoft still hasn't fixed the actual response time yet to an actual search. So um, I hope they do that in the future because um, as you can see, it does take a little bit of time. But nonetheless, um, that's currently what um, give or take a math solution looks like when you do a search for, as an example, an equation. Now, um, if we just head over to a screenshot uh, provided by Microsoft over on Twitter, this is what the new layout will look like. And uh, um, I did exactly the same search, and you can see that my search was quite complicated and cluttered, and the new format um, is a lot better and a lot simpler and a lot easier just to um, basically assess and get the information you need from that equation. So as mentioned, uh, the first change for today's video and um, better formatting for math solutions according to Microsoft that will be rolling out quite shortly and um, if you haven't seen it already to the new Bing chat. Now um, if we just head back to Bing, um, something I did post on a uh, last uh, month in February, about the middle of February, is that um, some users were starting to see ads in the new Bing basically uh, resulting in suggested ads in the generated conversational response of its chatbot. Now, that was some users, and just to let you know, although I'm also not seeing ads as yet, I have done a bit of experimenting before posting this video. Um, in a recent uh, blog post entry, Microsoft has um, basically announced that they are making plans for monetizing the chatbot with ads. So it's on its way. So if you haven't seen ads already, uh, this is something that Microsoft is in the process of starting to roll out to the new Bing with Microsoft saying in that blog post, and I'm quoting this, in addition to what we've already built into the preview experience, we are also exploring additional capabilities for publishers, including our more than 7,500 Microsoft Start Partner uh, brands. They carry on to say, we recently met with some of our partners to begin exploring ideas and to get feedback on how we continue to distribute content in a way that is meaningful um, in, in traffic and revenue for our partners. So um, like it or not, um, ads and monetization um, is on the way to the new Bing. Now, as mentioned, I did do a couple of searches regarding products, and I, d I haven't seen ads yet in my region. But once again, if we just head over to a screenshot provided by Microsoft in that blog post, this is more or less what you can expect to see. Um, yeah, you got a what they are calling a new expanded hover experience, and here we can see the ad in a search for latest healthcare capabilities. And um, if you hover over the link, um, it will basically if you hover over a link from that publisher, it will display more links, as we can see from the screenshot provided. And there's also a caption um, of Microsoft Start license content that will be placed next to the chat answer. So a lot going on, as we can see from the screenshot provided when it comes to ads with a new kind of hover over link experience or um, expanded hover experience as Microsoft is calling it. So that's just two changes I wanted to bring to your attention for the purpose of today's video. 
a better and math formatting uh, experience and also ads, like it or not, is on its way to uh, the new Bing chat. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.